to Florida now, where a closely watched event is about to get underway. NASA and SpaceX just a few hours away from the next rocket launch to the International Space Station. NBC's Marissa Parr, she's standing by at the Kennedy Space Center for us. Marissa, good morning. Craig, good morning. These blue skies bode well for a launch for Crew 11 from historic Launch Pad 39A. And we're told the crew is in good spirits. They are ready, Craig. Uh, the diverse team, it's a four-person crew made up of four different people, including two NASA astronauts. We also have a Japanese JAXA astronaut, a Russian cosmonaut, and they will link up with the seven people already on board the International Space Station and settle in for a six-month stay in space 250 miles above Earth. Now, this will be the fourth trip to the space station for a NASA pilot and Pennsylvania native Mike Fink, but this will be the first trip to space for NASA's crew commander, Zena Cartman. My mom, when I used to go to Antarctica, she would joke, well, at least you're still on Earth. Um, so, <laughs> sorry about that, mom. Not for long. <laughs> Not for long. If all goes according to plan, liftoff will be at 12.09 this afternoon with docking on Saturday. And Craig, Commander Cartman tells me she is bringing a photo of her mother so her mother can also feel like she is part of the ride. But I hope her mother is ready for some long distance phone calls, Craig. Uh, that's pretty cool. Pretty cool. Uh, Marissa Parr for us there. Marissa, thank you. Hey, thanks for watching. And don't forget, you can catch the Today Show every morning on NBC or take today when you're on the go. Just follow the Today podcast on Apple Podcasts, Spotify, or wherever you listen.